operations continue at this hour across the tri-state area. In the city, salt trucks will start hitting the streets at midnight. And parts of New Jersey are under a state of emergency where the worst, as Vanessa just mentioned, is expected. CBS 2's Kevin Rincon is live tonight in East Brunswick with the latest there. Kevin. And Jessica, we're right off the turnpike, and we've seen plenty of cars out on the roadways already. And with the start of a new work week after the holidays, we expect things to get even more crowded, which will only complicate things as this storm system moves in. For now, the worst of the snow is expected in New Jersey, where preparations are well underway. I wouldn't underestimate it. We know how it is out there in Jersey, and better be prepared for a situation and not have one than have a situation I'd be prepared for it, you know what I'm saying? Snowfall totals are wide ranging, but with the start of the new work week, any precipitation could make getting around a headache. With that in mind, the state is doing what it can to try and ease traffic during the morning commute. State offices will have a delayed opening tomorrow. Uh, those offices, unless you hear otherwise from us, will open at 10 a.m. Folks, if you can, uh, based on who you work for and your working circumstance, and you can sit the commute out, and delay that a little bit in the morning. Uh, that's probably a smart move, not just for you, but for the whole operation. Ahead of the storm, a state of emergency has been issued for Ocean, Burlington, Atlantic, Cumberland, and Cape May counties. Better get home then. It's about time. I think the COVID thing is, they need some time to go away, but we gotta just play by the day and just cross the fingers and move it forward. In the city, Mayor Eric Adams joined sanitation workers as they prep salt spreaders at a shed on Spring Street. We have an amazing, amazing department of sanitation that is going to start tonight to hit the ground and start spreading salt on our streets to be prepared for the predicted one to three inches of snow that we may have. We are definitely ready. We will be deployed on the overnight shift waiting for those first flakes to start and we will be salting throughout the duration of the snowfall trying to keep everybody safe. The sanitation department like many city agencies hard hit by the pandemic. It's down more than 20 percent of its staff. Workers are doing longer hours to help prepare for the storm. It's winter time, you're a sanitation worker, you're expecting to come in. So thankfully, the, that heroic lifestyle that they live in the winter time always comes true. And in the city, there is a travel advisory. The advice both there and in New Jersey, if you can stay off the roads tomorrow, please do. Live in East Brunswick, Kevin Rincon, CBS 2 News. Kevin, thank you.